Nina, I love you so much. Nina Agdahl said yes to Logan Paul, and now the couple can't wait to say I do. The recently engaged pair got emotional during Logan's swoonworthy proposal in Lake Como, Italy, and the YouTube star documented the romantic moment in a behind-the-scenes video on his channel this week. Logan couldn't help but shed a few tears as he prepared to get down on one knee and ask for Nina's hand in marriage, and the supermodel was quick to comfort her beau. Nina, I love you so much. I'm sorry. You're being so mean. I'm sorry. Baby, I love you so much. Put your phone away. I can't. Why? I can't. I'll tell you why in a second. You are the love of my life. You're the girl of my dreams. I never thought I'd find you. And now that I have, I never want to let you go. I'm sorry I'm being such a <laughs> Can you hit this button for me, please? Oh my god. Baby girl. <laughs> Will you marry me? The boxer also shared his process behind designing Nina's ring, and the sparkler was so impressive that even Logan's brother, Jake Paul, and their mom were left speechless at the mere sight of it. This wasn't like a ring I just bought. I picked out the diamonds first, then told them I wanted a platinum setting with bullet cut diamonds and talon prongs holding the main one. Oh my gosh, I think I know what it is. You crashed into me <laughs> bright. <sighs> Though the couple ultimately realized that Logan had gotten some bad intel about his lady love's ring size, their happiness overshadowed the small blunder. You told Milton that you were six and a half. Huh? Did you, did you tell Milton that you were a ring size six you and a half? You asked Milton for my ring size? I said if you can get it. How dare you? You knew it. Five I knew he blew five it. He said, you said five and a half? This mother f***er. He comes up to me in the morning, he goes, six and a half. No. I said, you got it? No. One size too big. Oh. I'm <laughs> We're engaged. We're engaged. Logan and Nina went IG official last December after keeping their romance under the radar for months. Once they were public, Logan reflected on the landmark year in his personal life and gushed over his then girlfriend in a candid vlog. I got to do so many cool things and meet so many cool people. And when you do that, you find out much more about yourself. And I think this year was the year that I kind of realized it's essentially who I am. And I'd like to consider myself an artist. My canvas just changes. And through those travels, I, I can't believe it. I got a girlfriend. <laughs> Welcome to this episode of Show and Tell. I have one Danish delight. Look, I love this girl. She is so great for me. Oh, you're a real glass guy. You want to She's just kind of the same person as me. I had considered myself a hopeless romantic, incapable of finding love or falling in love. Turns out I was wrong. There's hope out there for you kids. I love this girl so much. She's changed my life and she's been on this journey with me and I hope she's gonna be on it with me for a very long time to come. Love you, Nina. Damn, that was cheesy. Am I, if I'm blushing, cut this out. However, when Nina and I started dating, there's one thing she didn't know about me, and that's uh, I'm a nerd. I actually set the Guinness World Record this year. Oh my God, bro. For the most expensive Pokemon sale ever sold at a private sale ever, $5.2 million. You are officially amazing. Congratulations. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> That was balanced out by a $3 million loss when I accidentally bought a box of fake Pokemon cards. Oh my oh, God. God. Actually, they were G.I. Joe.